Hey guys, want good audio? Sure! Cause it's, cause it's sure. You can have kind of crappy video, you can have bad lighting, uh, but when it comes to a good video, audio makes it. And sure is trying to ensure that you're gonna have good audio the next time you're shooting with your phone. So this is the Shure MV88 Plus. Now this is a video kit. Uh, I actually have the regular MV88, relatively cheap when you're looking at all the mics on the market. And I use this all the time for voiceover auditions, for voiceover, a lot of times my unboxing videos, I use this because it's great just for audio. But when this was made, live streaming was not even around. So yes, there's a lightning port adapter. It just goes click right into your phone, which is nice. It's fine for recording podcasts. Hello, hello, you can change. So it's this bi-directional mic, which is awesome. Mic on top, mic on the sides. This is great, but they decided, hang on, there's a lot of people out there using their phones to create content, using lenses, like from Moment, I've talked about them before, or lighting kits. I'm using a light right now. Uh, this one is from Loom Cube. I'll put all the links in these, but these are great options for shooting great video. You need to have that kind of accessibility on your phone as well. And a lot of times, especially if you're recording in a, a loud environment, I mean, in here it's pretty quiet which is rare for New York. But if you're somewhere like a concert or a conference or whatever, and you wanna be live streaming, this is a great option. People always ask, Bradley, what do you do? I don't really know. But one of the things I do is a lot of live stream content for Honda and Acura. And every time I go, I bring my own kit. So essentially they hand me the Honda phone and I bring a lens, a light if we need it. Usually we don't, but I've got one just in case. Uh, and a microphone and usually hook it all up on a tripod. Now that takes this tripod. Uh, a separate lens kit, which is really convenient from in case, but this is kind of big, right? All of this stuff here, plus a microphone, the one I'm using up here, which is a Rode mic. And what Shure has done is put all of that right here. That's pretty remarkable. So, let's get into it. What do you get in the box? You get a lot of great stuff. First off, this is an awesome tripod. Great for hand-holding, great for quickly placing out. This is from Manfrotto. I'm a major fan of them. All of their products are great, from backpacks to tripods to ball mounts, all this kind of stuff. And uh, this is great. Does this adjust? Does that thing adjust there? Okay, so I think it is, I think it is adjustable. Maybe it's just tight. I don't know. I'm gonna figure that one out. So the moral of the story there is just don't mess with this. The roller, this is a really nice, almost like a neoprene material. All of it fits really great into here. What I love about this compact size is, boom, throw that in your backpack, easy. Tote bag, even a jacket with a big pocket. And you get inside the mount, cell phone clip. This will uh, clip on there. Now a lot of people online were saying that they didn't like that this was a cheap plastic. It is plastic, but I wouldn't call it cheap. It's got some nice bumpers up here to help hold your phone. It's got a nice metal mount at the bottom there, but uh, yeah, I think probably metal would be better. You get two cords, a lightning cord and a uh, micro USB. So that's good, Android and Apple. Because sometimes you get to set and you're like, oh, I'm shooting with someone else's phone. Oh, the this mount doesn't work with that because I'm used to my iPhone, so anyway. Um, this is a nice little, uh, that's the microphone holder. And of course, the major reason you're getting this equipment is this condenser microphone. Now there's so many specs on this, but suffice it to say, this combined with their app, which is fantastic, allows you to have a lot of flexibility. You can tell using the app, you can tell this microphone, I just wanna record here. I wanna record 360. I just wanna record using these two, that's bi-directional. I want mono, I want stereo, I want uh, all these different things. Uh, also on the back, you have a headphone jack, so you can monitor in live time your audio, and that's huge. Also comes with a little uh, kind of windscreen here. So let's assemble this thing. All right, so I have all this assembled here connector, my USB into lightning. Get a little light that comes on. Can you see that? 
Yeah, there we go. Lights on. Also, you can take the cord. That was kind of a smart move on their part. Now, another thing that I do sometimes when I'm shooting is I will actually turn the mic this way. Uh, really great way to, uh, to live stream. If you're just kind of somebody on the weekend or you're doing road trips or whatever, this thing is amazing because it gives you good audio and it's utilizing the great video that's already in the camera. Stop recording and boom, it goes right to my camera roll. I can change the resolution up to 4K on my phone. Uh, I can change the audio, whether it's 48 hertz or different, 24 frames a second, 30 frames a second, 60 frames a second, it'll do all of that. And it's got a whole bunch of great information in here as well. Here we go using the MV88 Plus condenser microphone. This is the video kit, uh, testing audio. And um, so that's with the microphone. Now wait. So this is without that microphone. Now Apple's microphones are usually pretty good anyway on their iPhones. So you may not notice much difference, but you definitely would if there was a lot of noise going on around. I would say the major difference is the sound quality is richer with the microphone. It's definitely clearer. Whereas when I take the microphone off, you can tell I'm in a small bedroom in Brooklyn. The Shure MV88 Plus video mic, this thing is about $250, I believe. And uh, if you're somebody who needs a great little setup at home, this, is really a remarkable way, especially I love that it all fits back in this bag. I'm gonna be taking it in a couple weeks to use it uh, on a shoot and really field test it then. But if you're somebody who just needs regular audio recording, podcasts or voiceover or whatever, this is a little bit cheaper and I think that makes the most sense. But like I said, having this whole kit in one makes this a big seller. There you go. Hey, thanks so much for watching. You need to subscribe. Also check me out on Instagram for up to the second things that are going on. I'm also going to do a review on here on Instagram, a shorter one, but this is a nice long one for you. So make sure you subscribe. If you have questions or comments, maybe you've got an MV88 Plus video kit and you want to tell me a little bit about it, put it below. I would love to talk to you about that. Or if you have other video kits that you like using, because I'm on the road shooting a lot and would love to hear about them. Thanks so much. Have an awesome day.